The path changed slightly, but it was just as simple. I'm sure the Master Diviner would say. Destiny only has one path. Your choices are just a predetermined solution to the puzzle. Actually, I don't think I agree. Master Diviner, let's reset the sandbox and give it another go, shall we? Again? Do it all over again exactly as it was? You can try it a million times over, and a million times over it is doomed to the same fate, because there is only one path. <laughs> I see what you're thinking, Ching Chue. You're an interesting one. Ching Chue? I've been thinking through the calculations for this puzzle. There really is only one solution. This maze was designed by Kiraloom. It's no use. There aren't any other solutions. As long as we're playing this so-called game of destiny, we can't win. No, there's a second choice. There will always be another choice. Miss Trailblazer, quick, say something to persuade her. I didn't mean like that. Ready to begin? Of course there's another solution to this sandbox. Listen to my idea. You're all gonna help, right? Correct. Miss Chingtra, I don't know how you're planning to solve the puzzle, but I'll support this squad to the end. Count me in. I'm sure Miss Chingchua has something up her sleeve. If we can help, I'm in. I only need two people for my plan to work. Destiny only has one path. Your choices are just a predetermined solution to the puzzle. You go stand in the sandbox. Right about that spot over there. <sighs> Next, Judge Ho Ho, you stand on the other side of the room. And stop shaking. All right, we're ready. And now the second path appears. Let's begin. Lead the Ingenium to the exit. Show me how many choices Destiny gives you. Impressive. This is the other solution. The alternative choice. I created a new solution. Master Diviner, you're not the only one who can design a puzzle. And I don't tread the path of destiny alone. <laughs> you think that by calling on your companions for help, you created a new path out of thin air? You're just playing with semantics. I could weave a thousand routes for you, but they lead to the same destination. So what significance is there in having a choice? Creatures like you don't understand humans. The universe is like jade tiles on a game table. 
When the tiles are shuffled, the outcome is already predetermined. Which tiles can be played? Which tiles are left over? What kind of hand the person next to you is trying to make? All of these can be determined through calculations. But if everything is just a calculation, the game loses its flavor. Randomness and adaptability, ambushing your opponent, twists and turns, the balance of the elements. It's a mix of calculations, unknowns, and loss of complete control that makes Celestial Jade the kind of game it is. And those are the same things that give life its color and vibrance. Do my choices at the game table mean nothing if I have a sure loss in front of me? No! The choices are what make the game meaningful in the first place. Even if I lose, I'll still make choices to lighten the loss. Just like the Master Diviner is making choices for her own agenda. You were right when you said that as Master Diviner, you must comb through the complex threads of destiny day after day, all for the preservation of this giant ship. In this vast universe, a game where there are only losers, our Master Diviner is making endless choices, fighting against the odds just so the Lawful can travel safely for another day. <laughs> In my book, she's the best player there is. Why would someone as talented as the Master Diviner go through the trouble of making endless choices if the end result is predetermined? Heliobus, you cannot fathom the joys of humanity. You are imprisoned by the illusion of destiny, unable to free yourself. And you want everyone who peeks into the future to suffer the same pain as you. You don't understand humans at all. Don't let them trick you, Fu Xuan. Don't push me away! Don't let her words fool you! Kiriloom, release the Master Diviner! I see through your trickery! I see through every bit of it! I'm going to lose! Victory is beyond my reach! Why? Why is there no alternative? Everything in this universe is predetermined. No, I... I had no path to victory. Stand still. I see through you. Together as one. Say bye to breathing. What are you waiting for? To betray my customers? I charge extra! Relax. A quick divination. May as well kill them all. More business at Stand still. Time to say bye. Boom. Say bye to breathing. All things in this world. Human creations! Just having fun. Get on up 
so good. <laughs> Master Diviner! Uh, are you all right? Uh, I... I'm fine. Just a small headache, nothing more. It's normal to experience some discomfort after being possessed by a Heliobus, but nothing a few medicinal pellets can't take care of. Uh, is that... Carolum? <laughs> they may not be the most powerful fragment, but becoming entangled in their illusion can lead to endless despair. Hurry! Just hurry up and... seal me in the darkness. I've foreseen what happens next. You're going to imprison me. Jingjue, thanks to you, the Divination Commission is safe again. No need to thank me, Master Diviner. By the way, while you were possessed, you fired me from the Commission. So... that counts, right? I'll have to ask you to give me written notice that my contract's been unilaterally terminated. Then, with all the years I've spent in the Divination Commission, I'll be able to get a great severance package! And I already planned what to do with all the money. I'm gonna open a gaming parlor, hire a couple of workers to run it, and spend the rest of my days living off the profits. I'll have started a new life without having lifted a finger. <laughs> Are there two Ching Chues? Uh, I see. <clears throat> what a pity. I don't recall anything I may or may not have said while possessed by the Healy of us. In any case, Qingjue, why are you still here? Shouldn't you be on duty back at the repository? Huh? M Master Diviner, you can't back out now! Of course I can. After all, there are always choices in life. You taught me that. <sighs> I can't convince real you, let alone possessed you. Master Diviner, you should get some rest. I'm gonna go take a br- I mean, get back to work.